I got a comment recently from not in use on YouTube, and they were asking if there's a way to cut your audio files once they're within Rough Animator. And there is a way to do this, and I'm going to show you how to do it on both the Mac and the iPad on today's episode of the Expat Animator. Hey, it's Patrick. Welcome to my Expat Animator series, where I try to help beginners, hobbyists, and independent animators create 2D animations. So let's switch over here to my screen share and I've already got a file created and I need to bring in the audio file. So let's go ahead and grab a little test audio that I made. And you can see that there's some dead space in the front and on the back. So we can just use our mouse and click and drag and get rid of that on each end of this. and. So that's one way to edit your audio or cut it within Rough Animator. Now you can move this file around. And the other thing that I tried to figure out and I couldn't find a way, so let me know in the comments if you know how to do this, is if there's a way to split the audio, like you, you would just like a blade tool in Final Cut Pro or something, and just click it and then you have two pieces. Now I couldn't find a tool to do that, but uh, here's a workaround so we can just come up here to modify layers we can duplicate that layer and then I can just get rid of the back on this one and I can get rid of the front on this one and now we have two audio files here and I can move them around the order I can I can even stack them so like if I played this we're gonna hear like a double audio so let's go ahead and listen to this for this is an audio recording for this so that's pretty cool that you can do that, and it's just a little bit of a workaround and not so bad. And let's go ahead now and switch over to the iPad and see if we could do the same thing. So let me grab my iPad here, and let's take a look at this file. So let's bring in our import some audio, and I've got the same file here, so let's just bring that in. And so what we need to do is pinch to zoom to see that whole timeline here. And you can see that we've got that same dead space. So I can just use my mouse uh, and I'm actually using a Bluetooth mouse right now with my iPad. Or you can use your Apple Pencil or just use your finger. Let me try my finger. And I can click and drag the ends of this off. So just like on the Mac. And now I can click and move this file around. And so let's see if we can duplicate this and see that we can do that same trick. So if I go to modify layers, we can duplicate it. And then I can trim off the front of this one and I can trim off the back of this one. And there we go. And then we, we can switch the order. We can stack them just like on the Mac. So it's pretty cool that you can do these audio editing tricks within Rough Animator. And it's nice to know that these features are constantly being added. So that hopefully answers your question. And if you have any more questions, uh, go ahead and leave them in the comments and I'll try and answer them. This has been another episode of the Expat Animator. Thanks for joining me today and keep on animating. If you found today's video helpful, you might like some of my animation classes over at Skillshare.com. I'll put the link in the description below.